Sisters, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Rain 2 episode 6 of season 2 of Fruit Basket. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I'm going to show it rain here. Are we talking about guns? Mamidi! Why, <laughs> 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 <Point> sorry. <laughs> oh, baby. <laughs> Oh god, that poor child. She had a heart attack. <laughs> oh god, like when you scare someone so good and they're like, <laughs> I can't and they're like, ah! <laughs> and then they're like, like, <laughs> oh, that pulse been like, <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, okay, well, never mind. Mm-hmm. Oh, maybe. Of course. I would love to sing Chicken. deserve it. <laughs> My god, yes, please. Because <laughs> if Aya and Hattie are coming, you have to go too. Yeah, did you finish your homework? Well, that's good for one of you. Oh, Toru. Oh my god, you poor baby. You can get it all done in one night. Mm, there's that hat again. Yeah. 
मेहरबानी See fireworks together. Yes, Cody. What is it, baby? What from? Mm hmm. This is a memory, it's a reminder, and I'm supposed to thank you. And maybe why you're gonna back. Mm -hmm. No God, Cody. Please don't hurt yourself, baby. Back up, please.
Ne? Ne? You poor baby. Yeah. Yeah, but she... <laughs> Wait, 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 he ha he still has jeans on. Let him take his jeans off. <laughs> He's already gotten wet and they're probably itchy now. Thank you for the plot of today's episode. I needed that today. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. You can tell, obviously, right then and there. She did as much as she wants to talk about it. She's not ready. But still, you can't butt your nose in everybody's business. And like I said, she's possibly not ready to talk about that yet.
do you mean? But You have to learn not to. That's why sometimes it takes time for someone to be window ready to just talk about what they want to talk about. You can't just be like, fuck it, I wanted to talk to you, I want you to talk now about it. But no. Oh my god. So let me guess, I thought her was still sleeping. <laughs> because that's what you get. It's written all over your face. Yeah, and she's down. So who do you think out of everyone will make her feel dumb? Either you or Kyo. Still an asshole like always, aren't you?
Yeah, but then it might trigger Yuki. Yuki's kind of already triggered. Can I come with? <laughs> Please. I knew it. It was obvious. I mean, like, thinking about it between season one and season two. Just been waiting. God, that just, it makes me feel to this day. Wonder why. And I'm not going to say, this is big spoilers, but I ain't going to say it. The end game of this show. And who ends up with who. <sighs> I just love Strip up so damn much, and they're just so cute together, and I can't. <laughs> Things can't ha always happen for a reason, you know? That's the sad thing, because you know how, like, sometimes when you ship a couple a lot, more than another couple, and then in the end, the couple that you want to get together don't get together in the end. That's what that is, and you can't deny that they have chemistry, but... <sighs> I'm about to cry again. <sighs> the only thing we have is fan fiction. Fan fiction galore. That's all you get. But this was a sweet episode. It was a it was a good a freaking episode. Thank you for the food. Thank you for the plot because I needed that today. Like, oh my god, Asaharu, my baby imprint. <laughs> Precious baby girl, we love her so fucking much. Like, oh, uh, but like, okay. Let's just say if Akito does come, because it feels like she is. Oh, God. I, I mean, we're going to be a fly on that wall no matter what, but I just felt like the issue or the tension between her, Yuki, Toru, everyone else, you know. It's going to be a hella awkward. I mean, mm. for a moment, like, I was thinking Ren was also going to go as well. But I, I really don't know. Mm -mm. I got no fucking clue. But, like, I still went happy. And I had to go, too, just to be there with sugar. Right? But, no, I don't know what's going to happen. I'm scared. But I'm also excited at the same time, too. But seriously, like, just any moment between Toru, whether it is Kyo... Or it's Yuki. You just, you can't help it. Like, they, she just looks so good with both of them. And as a show that is a reverse harem, where it is one freaking girl and so many freaking men, which is, you know, my dream. I think almost every, like, straight female's dream. Um. <laughs> and you have to, like, lead it down to one. It's hard. But, like, as I said, you can't deny that, like, she has chemistry with Yuki. And now with the fact is that, yes, he is the boy that, I mean, because, like, even when season one came and we got to that situation, and when he asked about it kind of a little bit, there were points where I was like, no, I still don't think it's him. I'm like, I'm going to say it's Kill because it's Kill. And then I kept thinking about it when the show was on break. And I kept thinking to myself, oh, it's got to be Yuki because why in the world would Yuki 
ask about it. I was like, typically, usually, let's talk about like any movie, TV show, whatever. Usually the person who ends up asking about, oh, hey, what's this? And why do you still have it? Why is it somewhat of a sentimental value for it? 50 out of 50, that person is the one who has that connection with, with that person. And usually 50 out of 50, they usually end up together. And it's not always true. Just 50 out of 50. Like, oh, I can't. My baby boy. Like, mm, I love him so much. Like, uh, And then Kittle and Kisa and that situation. Oh, my God. You had to make me cry over my daughter. Like, <laughs> he's a precious baby. We love her so much. But this was a really good episode. And I honestly cannot wait to see what in the world is in store for next week. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view to episode 6 of season 2 of Fruits Basket. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Monday for episode 7. Bye, guys.